It's me, it's me, it's Cool Guy Me. Welcome back to a brand new video, everyone. Episode 187, I believe. And we are starting off this episode with a battleground pack. Um, I don't know why we've got the animation for it now. Uh, the prep phase ends in 54 minutes. So, yeah, let's see who we get. Uh, Harden Jason Jordan. I believe the next card will be an ultimate. Damn, <laughs> I even forgot the order of my cards. The next one is an ultimate, I think. Then it's an elite. No, it's another ultimate. Elite, and this is an ultimate. Yeah, okay, I thought so. So, a very good... Well, for me, this is a very good deck. Anyway, um, as I said, it, we are late stages into this prep phase. Look at everyone. Oh. <laughs> no, I think most people did very, very well. Um, the Hoping King Steamer can get his charges in the next 54 minutes. I know Roman, um, I'm pretty sure Roman's not going to charge at all. Uh, who else we got? Elevated, uh, under 100 there, missing a couple cards. Hopefully he could finish up. Everyone else is maxed, very good. Um, I'm obviously going to energize all my cards but off camera. I don't want to bore you guys with that, but actually, well, we'll, we'll do the Bray Wyatt. Let's just do the let's get this Bray Wire done. I'll do the rest of Cam. I'm still looking for two more energies, but we should get those two energies in this video as well. Uh, where are we at? 15. They really need that charge all button I was talking about in the six things I want in the next supercard update. Really, be so helpful. Anyway, um, okay, Bray's done. We've got King Ring Rewards, which we're going to get into in a little bit, actually. Yeah, in a little bit. It's not very interesting. I'll show you where we got to, but yeah, not too interesting. But what we do have that is interesting, that is Road to Glory. Uh, got home from a long day of work today and had to get on that grinding train, but we are going to manage to do it. Two games left to play, an hour and 32 minutes left. We have got two bouts. Let's go ahead and get these games played. Uh, we'll play one game, we'll, we've got that voice crack, we'll play one game, we'll do the uh, King of the Ring reward, and then we'll go back into some uh, into another game of RTG, and yeah, get the pro John Cena. Not too sure when I'll get him pro'd by, um, shouldn't take me too long, I don't think, I've, obviously I've already got one of the John Cena's done. There really aren't many cards that I'm going to need to pro anyway, like event cards every week and a half, uh, two weeks. Um, it's not really, is it? Is it an event? Is it one one event pro every two weeks or just under? I don't really know, but those cards. And if I don't open any packs, well, no, no Hall of Fame, no throwbacks. And then the only normal WrestleMania cards I've left to perfect pro is John Cena. Um, normal. So yeah, even Roman Reigns at this point, I'm gonna silver star him. So yeah, uh, we're only, we're literally looking for a John Cena. That's pretty much the only pro left to do unless I open more packs and obviously event cards. But really hoping for a new tier soon, guys. I know we go on about this a lot. I know when I say we, because we pretty much all want a new tier. Um, you know, I want a new tier. But what I want more than a new tier, actually, is probably Season 4. I'd be more pumped for Season 4 than I would be for a new tier. Um, obviously, they, they would have to work it out, you know, try and make everyone happy with the new Season 4, because I know a lot of people say if it's a complete reset, that they're going to stop playing Supercard. Uh, a lot of people have actually commented that in my comments over the last couple of weeks, talking about new updates and potential resets and all of that. So, well, yeah, maybe Supercard can figure out something to, you know, so that we don't or Well, I wouldn't if it was a complete reset, you know, if, like, back, you know, to, like, Legendary, <laughs> Legendary being, like, the highest tier or something. <laughs> I would love that. I know some people wouldn't. Even I, I say I would love that, and yet I have spent an insane amount of money on this game. It's just, it makes it so much funner, doesn't it, starting from the beginning again? Well, I, f I feel that way, at least. When I say starting from the beginning, I know it makes a lot of people be like, oh, well, I've just spent so much effort and time getting all these amazing cars, and it's all for nothing. Well, hopefully they'd figure out something that it's not all for nothing, that you do, there is, you know, a little, you know, I don't know, maybe something can carry on into Season 4. I don't know how they'd work it out, but yeah, maybe something like that. Anyway, one game down, one game to go. Um, but yeah, talk about this new update. Yeah, like, Season 4, would it have a reset or not? Or would it just be, like, from Season 2 to Season 3? Who knows? Um, I, I, I really think they need to add a new event. PCC, I think we've moved... I think, you know, by now they would have put it back in the game. So I don't think PCC's ever coming back. 
But who knows, maybe another game mode, like an event, because we need a new event game mode. Anyway, contender brackets, show you where we got, and we got core cool bump, very interesting, I know, forgot to energize. Oh well, let's claim these rewards. One ultimate, why not? Bobby Roode, Big E, um, Nikki Bella, Dana Brooke, uh, just, yeah, come on, be lucky. Hey, I never will be, I'll never be upset to pull an Alexa Bliss. But unfortunately, I have no purpose for that Alexa Bliss, so that kind of sucks. Um, what else? Yeah, let's get straight into another RTG game. That is the main thing we've got to do right now. What do I think of this picture? God, it's very generic, is it? It's like a lot of other pictures, just his generic t-shirt, generic cap. He's doing the salute, but I mean, it's just, it is very generic. It's not... They, they could have done like a... Like, he's gonna have a flag match. He, they could have had a custom card, just like the Seth Rollins, the Alistair Black, something. But no. But no, they opted. They opted not to do that. But I think it's a shame. I think I think every every event card should be different because the event card they're meant to be. Well, they're event. Yeah, they're event cards. An event. One event. It's meant to be. Like, I don't know. It's meant to be unique. And they're really not, are they? <laughs> they're really not. Um, what are we two two nil down? Let's sidetrack from. Um, yeah, let, let, okay, yeah, we're gonna do this for a long, I've, I don't think I've ever done this on this channel, but we're gonna talk sports, but we're not actually gonna talk WWE, and we're not gonna talk football, uh, wow, I know, mind blown, but, uh, let's talk a little bit, just, just a brief second, as looking, you know, I'm always finding interesting things to talk about, but I know not, uh, not everyone will follow what I'm about to talk about, but that is tennis, and especially Wimbledon, for everyone who, maybe UK viewers, most of you will know about Wimbledon at least, and if you don't watch it necessarily, your family probably watches it. It's quite big Wimbledon, you know, especially for people in the UK. Uh, and yeah, tennis for everyone who doesn't know what Wimbledon is. But yeah, Roger Federer, what you know, it, fantastic, isn't he? Fantastic. You know, you take you take like I don't know Ronaldo, um, John Cena. Who's a good basketball player? Uh, LeBron James, if I if that if I even said that right, and then like Roger Federer, make you make like an elite team of what everyone in the bit. No, I'm like that. That would be sick, like a Suicide Squad but sports version. Um, yeah, Roger Federer. Wow, didn't drop a set. Whole of Wimbledon, really like made made Chilich cry like a bitch in the final. Um, you know, I feel yeah, I felt sorry a bit for Chilich. Quite liked him, uh, but yeah, was yeah. Sad to see Andy Andy go out quite quite quick, you know, for Andy Murray to go out quarterfinals. Um, but yeah, overall it was, it was pretty. It was a pretty uh, pretty fun uh, from Wimbledon. Let me know in the comments, guys, if you watched it, if your family watched it, what you have to say about it and all of that. And let's get back onto some WWE. Um, what can we talk about about WWE? Because there's a lot of things coming up. Um, mainly, the, the, where most of the news is going is, well, there's two kind of news things that I've, you know, uh, gathered. Is that is the f what is going to be the main event of SummerSlam? Is it going to be Brock Lesnar versus Roman Reigns? And Shelton Benjamin uh, returning soon, potentially. And obviously, this Kurt Angle... Uh, reveal which is actually happening very soon, which I'm really excited for. I don't know. I don't actually remember the last time I was this excited for a Monday Night Raw. Um, it is technically tonight because it is now 1:30 in the morning, so it is it is technically tonight. Um, but I might be working tomorrow, so it's gonna it's gonna be a good reward at an end with the. If I'm working on Tuesday, there's no way I can stay up to like five in the goddamn morning to watch Raw. It's ridiculous. We've just got John Cena. I did not even react, but John freaking Cena, pro, another event pro, or one more event pro. The next of well, the next event card when I get him pro, he's gonna he's this is gonna be a full event uh event pro ring domination. That's gonna be very interesting. But yeah, we're just. These decks are just absurd at this point. Absolutely absurd. My worst card is AJ Styles. <laughs> that is crazy. If I get a John Cena, Seth will be my worst. It's just, they're just all the best cards, really. Can't really get much better, you know, apart from 
all the all the Hall of Fames and some throwbacks and some fusions to really get rid of all of these regular WrestleMania cards. But apart from that, and it's only getting them better only a slight bit, not much better. There is not much better. Not obviously not saying that like you know bragging about it. Everyone's what well, everyone in WrestleMania to everyone who you know is very active in this game are at the point I'm at. So it's, it is kind of frustrating that we're we're not getting new updates. Uh, f- Frequently enough, and the last update. Well, the last update was utter garbage. Uh, anyway, but yeah, thank you guys so much for watching this video. Hope you guys have enjoyed it. Um, drop a like on the video. Let me know what you guys think about my new intro because I looked at my new intro on the last video. Because since the last video, I've been doing. I did that. It feels a little bit cringe, but <laughs> let me know what you guys think. It's probably better than hey, yo guys, what's going on? I don't know. Let me know in the comments about Wimbledon and all of that, um, and about you know. Well, actually, what is it about? Yeah, what do you guys think is going to happen on Raw with the Kurt Angle, the storyline? Who's going to come out? Who's, What's going to be the angle with this? Let me know in the comments. Anyway, guys, I'll see you tomorrow for a brand new video and potentially a stream. Till then, take care and peace out.